How's it going? Hey. What is this all about? Am I on video? You are. Okay, we're here to educate the public to not circumcise their boys and girls and to keep their babies whole. I'm, I'm for that. Because I was circumcised, I argue with my wife about it all the time. Oh dear. Well, you know, if you go to our Facebook page, which is Blood, Blood Stained Men, you can find information on foreskin restoration. And you can also help educate the next generation and protect boys and girls in the future. It's very empowering for victims to help stop this. Once and for all, the UN is against it. Other countries are against it. Physicians all over the world know it's wrong. The United States started circumcising boys and girls 100 years ago to prevent masturbation. We know today, of course, that's ridiculous. And parents continue to do it just because. They didn't know, they didn't have the information. Now we have the information and we're trying to disseminate it. We're trying to educate physicians and educate parents to protect babies in the future. How can we com combat against uh, the religious fanatics who do this? Well, there are religions that do it. But those religions also have intactivists inside of their religions and they are working within their religions to form new ceremonies that replace cutting with a, a peaceful welcoming into the religion, peaceful welcoming into society. Um, on Facebook you can find, a, excuse me, you can find a group called Jews Against Circumcision. There's also a group called Muslims Against Circumcision. So you can get information there for that. Got it. I'll take one of your... Uh one of your flyers and thanks for uh, taking the time to speak with me the evil empire okay so why do they require circumcision the empire needs soldiers to be demoralized wounded soldiers How you doing? Good. All right. What does it mean? It means without the jacket, how do you jacket yourself? <laughs> That's how you say to jack off in Mexican Spanish. Is chaquetearse. Okay. Do you, do you speak Spanish? Yes, I certainly do. Okay, do you want to say, uh, give me a sound bite for our Spanish-speaking friends? Uh, yes. No, and and make, don't make it X-rated. <laughs> this is X-rated, right this up here. Family. That's enough. Okay. Uh-huh. Este, lo erótico se dice aquí mismo, en la cartelera. Okay, and here's a goody one here. This is from an Egyptian tomb bay. Is this from an actual uh, hieroglyph? Yeah. Very yeah, good. and it is a young man. It's a young man who's being restrained by an assistant from behind. He's holding him, and the circumciser is squatting down and cutting his penis with a sharp stone. Got it. And the oldest archaeological record goes back 5,000 years to the caves of West Africa. There you go. Very good. And I have one parting comment. If you're circumcised, you will use lubricant for the rest of your life because you don't make your own. They took that away from you. And remember, babies are born perfect, and we should keep them that way.